So why don't you introduce, um, you know, Saatchi, William, Mahmoud and Florence about what to, you know, what's going to be happening at the night? Of course I can, yeah. So um, you asked the question before, what does Bulgaria look like or sound like? So yes. we'll give you a little clip of that. Yes. Um, this is uh, the Baron and the Baroness. It's a very, very little short clip. Uh, well, it's not a clip, they're going to do it live for you right now. And uh, the Baron's heard about this car and he wants it. He wants it like a toy, you know, like it's this, the next best thing that he mm. wants. Um, so this is, this is, off you go. I want it, I want it, I want it. Then you must have it, my little teddy bear. Nothing's too good for the Baron of my dreams. Nothing? But can't I have something? I will get you your car. <clears throat> Call the spies. The spies! And that's it. There you go. Wow. Yeah, they're pretty cool, wow. aren't they? <laughs> With the whole accent and everything. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Is that how it actually the original production sounds like? Is that how it's supposed to sound like? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, honestly, these guys have, have worked very, very hard to make sure the accents are right. Um, yeah, absolutely. So next, what could we expect from William and Florence? <laughs> right, so what, what we're going to go for right now, the first one is uh, Will's going to sing a little bit a cappella. So it's, it's quite hard to, to pitch this, but he's going to try it anyway, because uh, he's awesome. Um, and Will's singing probably one of the most mature songs in the musical. It's called Hushaby Mountain. Um, a number of people have covered it over the last sort of 50 years, really. Wow. Um, um, and yeah, it's, it's, all, it's actually the lullaby that his wife, who died, used to sing to the children. Um, so it's quite beautiful, it's got some lovely context. Over to you, Will. Whenever you're ready, Will. A gentle breeze from Hushabai Mountain Softly blows o'er Lullaby Bay It fills the sails of boats that are waiting Waiting to sail your worries away Fantastic. Yeah, he's good. Isn't he? uh, but I mean, honestly, Will, to find Will in a school like ours, um, he's 14 years old and he's playing a part that I would typically not give to somebody younger than 17, you know, so 18, 17 year old, you'd be thinking a year 13 would be playing this part. So, so the GIST Performing Arts uh, Division department's very lucky to have someone talented as Will. Oh, absolutely. I mean, music department, drama department, art department, DT department, you know, we work really closely together. Um, to create this production, you know, um, and performing arts at GIS, you know, we're about we're about taking whatever the student has and amplifying that. You know, in this country, the creative industries are really important, you know, and and we at GIS try to support them as much as humanly possible. Um, we're going to finish off with a Florence. A, 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 it's actually a duet. It's actually a duet between okay. Florence and Will. And right at the end of the play, it's a really cool section actually. Um, Baron and the Baroness. Uh, the Baroness brings out his present, and the present is actually two dolls, life-size dolls. One of them is Florence on a music box that spins round, and she performs a very staccato which performance, which means like, like short and stoppy and starty. Yeah. Yeah. And Will is playing the part of almost like a puppet uh, with long hair, and therefore his, uh, even longer than his own, and uh, he's got long hair. Um, uh, and he sings a bit which is nice and legato, so we have this lovely contrapuntal rhythm going on between the two. Alright, let's do this. This is Doll on a Music Box. Truly scrumptious, you're truly, truly scrumptious. Scrumptious as a cherry peach parfait. When you're near me, it's so delicious. Honest, truly. You're the answers to my wishes, truly you cannot see scrumptious, how much though I, I to may be seem free. presumptuous. Never, ever, ever go away. My heart beats so truly because I love you truly. Oh. They're good, eh? Wow, so, when are they going to be performing? Friday, Saturday and Sunday? Yeah, uh, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. What are the Sunday? times? It is uh, 7.45 on Friday and Saturday. Uh, and then on Sunday, it's 2 o'clock. Okay, so you have to be there on time. Um, uh, Anne was telling me that how 
just very strict. We start 7.45, doors close at 7.45. Absolutely. So what, what we do is actually... Um, when would you advise them to come? I would say be in your seat at 7.40. So arrive around 7.30, 7.35. Um, if you arrive late, you will have to wait maybe two scenes before you get in. Um, you'll be held outside, basically, to make sure that the magic of the theatre is maintained. And the parking is, is difficult, as yeah. you know. Now, even though you only have about 40 tickets left, I'm, I'm sure there are people who want to go and buy these tickets. Um, at what age would you recommend, I mean, from how, from how old, and also where can you get these tickets from? Okay, so we're recommending eight years and above. Um, the tickets are available from the Visitor Centre at GIS where you can go down to the shop in the visitor center and you can buy it there uh, or buy them there. Uh, they range from $10 to $35 a ticket. Is there a phone number so that you know, people who go to the shop don't get disappointed um, you know, when, when, there is, when, when they go there, there's no number? I mean, there, there are no tickets left. Uh, yes, there is. It's 241-1000. There you go. I've just been told that by, two, by four, Anne. 241-1000. There you go, thanks. Okay, so call that number <laughs> Thank and you. ask Chili Chili Bang Bang tickets. Any, 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 any tickets left? Yeah. All right. Any final words? Um, actually, Mahmoud said he wants to give a shout out. So, you know, I'm sure the rest of the students as well. You know, Florence, William, Sachi. It is your chance. Shout out time. Shout out to the uh, child catcher. who's played by Hiram Jalees. And the grandfather. They told me to do this. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's nice. <laughs> yeah. And Florence. Yeah, I mean, shout out to the whole cast, really. They're all amazing, so. Um, shout out to uh, Krishna Kasim and um, James Bryan and Ben Corman. My Instagram name is William.Bryan. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Marvellous. <laughs> My Instagram is it's a charm. Just <laughs> shout out to my cat named Wasabi and my pet <laughs> home. There you go. Nice. Uh, William, finally. Uh, just, just to say, um, you know, thank you very much for, for having us on this morning. It's really, really appreciated. And, and, you know, thanks for the support that Crystal FM gives us. It's, it's really, really appreciated. Yeah, all right. Well, there you go. We've heard it from them. Uh, for those of you who want to go get your tickets, you can call 241-1000. Or uh, if you have family and friends working at JIS or going to school at JIS, you can you know, have someone to get it for you. At the school, at, at the shop, yeah, yeah, the visitor centre. The visitor there's a shop. Center, there's, there's a, a shop, shop there. there. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Looking forward to uh, you know the production on Friday.